This is the Park Kitty Kid 76 here, and now I will do my review of the semi-finals of the game, as well as third place and a championship finals, in my last discussion of the Copa America Centenario 2016, since I wasn't doing this video for the past two weeks after I came back from vacation to Florida. And we hope you had a great 4th of July weekend. But the reason why is that I supposed to go see fireworks in the Hudson River and Weehawken is because I'm not going to see over there because it's too rainy to go see fireworks. But I just posted more fireworks. The ones I uploaded from the screen recorder is the 4th of July fireworks in East River and the other one in Jersey City and some of the videos from the fireworks that are on Facebook. If you haven't seen some of the recent video of the fireworks, Go check out my third channel, I Love Fireworks 1976. They have all of the 4th of July fireworks, the ones you just saw in this video so far. Now without further ado, let's see what's on the Wikipedia page to see the results that I didn't give you a recap from last two weeks of the semifinals and all the way up to the finals in the Copa America Centenario 2016. Now let's switch over to the computer screen recorder. Now before I can go on to the semifinals, the third place and the finals, I'm going to see what's going on in the quarterfinals to show the results of the game. Yep, this is our quarterfinals. These are knockout stages that we just saw. On June 16 in Seattle, United States 2, Ecuador 1 goal. A and on the 18th uh, in Foxborough, Argentina 4 and, and Venezuela 1 goal. In East Rutherford on June 17, Peru and Colombia are goalless, and then a penalty kick, Colombia 4 and Peru 2, and then Santa Clara on June 18, Chile 7 and Mexico goalless, and then a semifinals in Houston on June 21st, United States no goals and Argentina 4 goals, and Chicago on June 22nd, Colombia no goals and Chile 2 goals, and on the third place in Glendale, on June 25th, Colombia won, and United States no goals. And then the final championship game will it be in East Rutherford on June 26th. The Eastern had a goal for Argentina and Chile, our goalless, but in the penalty kick, Chile 4 and Argentina 2. The winning championship of the game is Chile for the 2016 Copa America Centenario. You can see the quarterfinals, if you just saw, on June 16, the last two weeks will be United States 2 and Ecuador, one goal, two kicking goals for the U.S., and one kicking goal for Ecuador. Peru and Colombia are goalless. And on the penalties, Peru 2, Colombia 4. And on the players will be the kick right there. I, I see the check marks will be winning for the kick, and the X marks could be missed the goal but Colombia made a four goals for the penalty kick as well as Peru well had two check marks for the goal and then the other one with the X's to m for missing goals now on to the uh, June 18th Argentina 4 and Venezuela 1 goal three players will be kicking goals for Argentina and Venezuela the player will be one kicking goal and then Chile and Mexico 7 and nothing. There are three of the players who made a kicking goals. And then the semifinals on June 21st. Argentina 4 and United States no goals. Argentina plays on the uh, plays the team for, with the three kick goals. And on the 22nd, Chile 2 and Colombia no goals. These are the two two players that are kicking goal. And the third place playoff, Colombia and United States won nothing. So the Colombian soccer player made a one kicking goal. And then the finals of the game, they're supposed to be at the score for Argentina and Chile, goalless. But in the penalty kicks, Chile 4 and Argentina 2. You can see Lionel Messi and other teams missed the, go missed the goals two of the missed goals and the other check mark for the penalty score but on Chile they play four penalty scores and one penalty miss so as I said the winning championship for the Copa America Centenario final is Chile 
but after they play for Argentina and Chile, you know, the Argentina soccer player Lionel Messi had very disappointed in this game because he didn't want to play any more of this game for Argentina. Well, I don't know. As you can see right there, for example, Copa America Centenario final. So this is what will be in MetLife Stadium in East Brotherford, New Jersey. Yep, this is a background, the routine to the finals. The rounds will be Argentina and Chile. If you want to see this, uh, the entire route of the, of the finals, just go ahead and do something. Argentina and Chile. No goals and then a penalty kicks. The Argentina jersey could be for blue and white jersey on the shirt. The white shirt and the white and blue socks. And Chile and jersey. Red t-shirt and red shorts and the blue socks. And you can see those teams here if you want to go in, in some places. You can see men of the match, the, st the statistics and everything. And then there's a post-match. Well, you know. The ones I didn't give you a recap of what was going on for the semi-finals, the third place and the final. So this will be a United States and Ecuador, Peru and Colombia, Argentina and Venezuela, Mexico and Chile. The semifinals, United States and Argentina. The third place playoff, United States and Colombia. And then a final, Argentina and Chile. So, these are goal scorers. All these scores from this goal. And you can see the tournament ranking. You can see the rankings of the team. And then there's a winner for this game will be Chile. Here are the individual awards. If you can follow along with this. And then the team of the tournament. The goalkeepers, defenders, mid defenders and forwards. You can see a sponsorship if you want to go there. And there's a match ball. And then there's a theme song. And then... That's all there is. Now let's see what's going on for this link of the official Copa America Centenario 2016 website. It says, thank you for being a part of the history. But in a MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey, Chile wins Copa America Centenario but on the penalty kicks, which is Chile 4 and Argentina 2, if you could do the match details. And their final score here of the, for the past two weeks, USA no goals, Colombia one goal. And the awards for the Golden Boot top scorer, Eduardo Vargas. Golden Ball most valuable player, Alexis Sanchez. And Golden Glove best goalkeeper, Claudio Bravo and the man of the game and you can see the match of the game over here it says best 11 you can see all the 11 teams for the Copa America Centenario and you can see the highlight clips right there you can see the videos and everything if you want to do that and you can see the match gallery like I do for example tournament and review there's Lionel Messi and there's other players. There's Lionel Messi again. And there's players, the ones we, we've been doing. And there's a victory for the game, which is Chile. And some of their players, if you want to go see it, the, the entire photo galleries of Copa America Centenario 2016, just go right ahead like we do it, an example. And all of these uh, images, if you want to go ahead and show those things. So this is the standings, the ones we just saw for this team. But now we move over to the quarterfinals. Here are the winners group A and the runner-up group B on June 16, match 25. USA 2 and Ecuador 1 goal and a winner group D and a runner-up group C 
on June 18 with match 27, Argentina 4 and Venezuela 1 goal. And on the 17th, the winners of the Group B and the runner-up of the Group A, Peru and Colombia goalless, the penalty kick, Colombia 4 and Peru 2 on match 26. And on match 28, winner Group C and the runner-up Group D on June 18. Chile 7 and Mexico no goals. Now let's move on to the semi-finals. The winner match 25 and the winner match 27. Argentina 4 and USA no score on match 29th on June 21st. And on the 22nd, winner match 26 and winner match 28. Colombia no goals and Chile 2 goals on match 30. And the third place playoff, the losers match 29 and the losers match 30. Colombia won and USA no goals. And last but not least, the final championship game for the Copa America Centenario 2016. Argentina and Chile are goalless, but in a penalty kick, as I said, Chile 4 and Argentina 2. So the winner of the championship at the Copa America Centenario 2016 is Chile. Yep. It's been an amazing thing that's ever been in my life. You can see it right there, we'll already show you. And it says, thank you for being part of a history at Cup America Centenario. You can go on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So, yep, that has been an amazing game for this entire month of the Cup America Centenario 2016. Well, and that wraps up the event for this entire month of Copa America Centenario 2016. Now I'm going to do one last thing before I wrap this up to be my final thought in this discussion video. Well, it's been around 100 years of the team for the Centennial Copa America and all of the men soccer internationally from the teams of the traditional tournaments in every history of the game. I know every fans are been excited because it's been an event for the entire month of this year's more passion and they've been cheered for the rest of the group stages all the way up to the championship finals. I couldn't be the same without missing a thing to watch it at home or some place to watch the entire event for the Copa America Centenario 2016. We hope you enjoy the rest of the tournament event of the entire month and everyone been excited because we thank you for supporting our team will be in the Copa America Centenario 2016. And that's the end of my discussion video. My next video will do something different that it is coming up soon. Until then, this is the Park Kitty Kit 76. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.